Hey guys welcome back to my channel. In this video you will learn how to name complex molecules containing different functional groups. Which are including Ketone Aldehyde Alcohol Carboxylic Acids Esters Amines and Amides Haloalkanes If you do not have information of how to name basic components, please watch the part 1 video first. So, you can have pre-knowledge about this topic. But before that make sure to subscribe to our channel and turn the notification on. Ketones and aldehydes have the same functional group. Their functional group is called carbonyl group. This functional group is the carbon double bonded with the oxygen. But in different location in the main chain. For aldehyde the carbonyl functional group is always at the end of the main chain. Therefore it gets the suffix of al. And for the ketone it is within the main chain. Therefore it gets the suffix of 1. These suffixes should be written immediately after the locant. Alcohol has functional group called hydroxyl functional group. This group contains of oxygen single bonded to hydrogen. Therefore the name of the molecule will get the suffix of ol. Carboxylic acid has functional group called carboxyl functional group. It means that it contain both hydroxyl and carbonyl functional group. Bonded with a single covalent bond. Therefore when naming the organic compound the suffix oic acid. Esters has the carbonyl functional group. But attached to the one oxygen which that oxygen atom is attached to another carbon. Therefore the suffix of the organic compound will be oat. Amines are a class of organic compound that contains amino functional group. And their names include the suffix amine. Amides are a class of organic compound that has been derived from carboxylic acids. The amides contains carbonyl functional group attached to an amine group. Therefore the suffix is amide. Keep this information in your mind because you will need them when namic following examples. Note that the examples will be graph in the linear structure. Which it means every joining peak means there is carbon atom present. Here is an example of alcohol group. Follow the steps so you learn them easily and remember them in your exams. In this alcohol compound. As you can see there are 7 carbon atoms in the main chain. Therefore it has prefix of hept. On carbon 4 there is one methyl group attached to it. Thus it has locants of 4 methyl. Remember that the alcohol group sends with ol. Therefore the name of this organic compound is 4 methyl heptanforol. Here is another example of the alcohol group. Go ahead and pause the video and give it a try. There are 5 carbon atom in the main chain. Therefore it has prefix of pent. There is an ethyl group at the carbon 3 of the main chain. Thus the name starts with 3 ethyl. As you can see there is a hydroxyl group. As such, the name end with suffix of ol. In general the name of the molecule will be 3-ethylpentanol. Note that it can be written as 3-ethylpentan-1-ol. Keep this mind that if the functional group is in carbon, there will be no need to mention the place of the functional group. Therefore both of the names are correct. Her is anther example. Feel free to give it a try. There are three carbon atom in the main chain. Therefore the prefix is prop. The compound contains hydroxyl functional group in carbon 2. Therefore the name ends with 2 ol. Thus the name of the molecule is propan 2 ol. Ketones. The ketones can be easily identified. As there is a carbonyl functional group in the middle of the main chain. Here is an example of ketone atoms. As you can see there is 5 carbon atom in the main chain. Therefore the prefix is pent. There is a methyl group attached on carbon 2 and carbon 4. Therefore the locant is named 2,4-dimethyl. Note that because this molecule is ketone. As such the name ends with 1. 2,4-dimethylpentan 2,1. Here is another example of the ketone. Feel free to give it a try. Note that there is a bromo atom at the end of the main chain. Therefore when naming the molecule. The word bromo should be used. As you can see there are 5 carbon atom therefore the prefix pent will be used. Note that the location of the bromine molecules should be written at the start of the name. Such as 5-bromo. Therefore the name of this molecule will be. 5 bromo 21 2 one indicates the location of the carbonyl functional group. Here is another example of the ketone compound molecules. Pause the video and give it a try. There are 5 carbon atom. Therefore the prefix will be pent. There is a methyl group attached on carbon 3 of the molecule. Therefore the molecule name starts with 3-methyl. 
as such the name of this molecule will be 3 methylbutan 2 1 the 2 indicates the location of the carbonyl functional group here is another example there are 5 carbon atom in the main chain therefore the prefix is pent there are no functional group except the carbonyl functional groups therefore the name of this molecule will be pent 2 1 aldehydes here is an example of the aldehyde functional group there are there are four carbon atom in the main chain therefore the prefix is but note that there are one methyl functional group and hydrogen atom attached to the main chain therefore the locant is 2 methyl as such the name of the molecule will be 2 methyl butanol here is another example as you can see there are three carbon atom in the main chain therefore the prefix is prop there are one hydrogen atom and bromine atom, as well as methyl group on carbon 2. Therefore, the locant is 2 methyl. The name of this molecule will be 3 bromo 2 methyl propanal. Esters. Here is an example of esters. Note that there is one main chain which it is the one that has alkoxy functional group. There are four carbon atom in the main chain. Therefore, the prefix is but. There is another chain that has been bonded to oxygen atom. Therefore the locant will be 3-bromopentyl. As such the locant will be used at the bending of the name. Therefore the name of the molecule will be 3-bromopentyl-2-chlorobutana-8. Note that because it is an ester compound. The name ends with O. Here is another example. Feel free to give it a try. There are two carbon atom in the main chain. Therefore the prefix is F. There is one methyl atom attached to the oxygen atom. As such the name starts with methyl. The name of this molecule will be methyl ethanoate. Note that the name ends with oat because it is an ester organic compound. Amines. Here is an example of amines compounds. There is one alkyl functional group attached to the nitrogen atom. And one alkyl functional group on the other side of the nitrogen atom. And because this is an amine compound their names includes the suffix of amine. The name starts with pentyl. As such the name of this molecule is pentylmethylamine. Here is another example. There are one methyl attached to the nitrogen atom in the right. And there is one ethyl group attached to the left. And one hydrogen atom on the top. Therefore the name of this molecule is ethyl methylamine. Amides. Here is an example of amides or organic compound. As you can see there is a carbonyl functional group. And amine functional group. Adjacent to each other. Therefore the name of the molecule is methanamide. Here is another example of amides. Feel free to pause the video and give it a try. 3 are 3 methyl group attached on carbon 1. Therefore the name includes trimethyl. There are 2 methyl group attached on the nitrogen atom. Therefore the name starts with N, 2 comma 2 trimethyl propanamide. Nitriles. Her is another example of nitrile group. As you can see there are a carbon triple bond to nitrogen atom. Therefore the name of the molecule includes suffix of nitrile. There are three carbon atom. Therefore prefix is prop. There is one bromine atom on carbon 2. Thus the name starts with 2-bromo. As such the name of the molecule is 2-bromopropane nitrile. Here is another example of nitriles. There are three carbon atom in the main cahen. Therefore prefix is prop. There is one carbon atom triple bonded to nitrogen atom. Thus the name ends with nitrile. There is one methyl group attached to carbon 2. The locant is 2 methyl. As such, TH named for this organic compound is 2 methyl propan nitriles. Haloalkanes. Haloalkanes are a class of organic compound that contains fluorine atom. There are 6 carbon atom in the main chain. Therefore, the prefix will be hex. There are 2 fluorine atom on carbon 2 and 4. Therefore, the name starts with difluorine. As such the name of this molecule will be 2,3-difluorine hexan. Here is another example of haloalkanes. Feel free to pause the video and give it a try. There are 4 carbon atom in the main chain. Therefore the prefix of the molecule is but. There is 1 fluorine atom on carbon 2. Therefore the locant is 2-fluoro. The name of this molecule is 2-fluorobutane. Here was the lesson for today. Thank you for watching my video.